Cloud Computing Architecture Presented by Zero2ProTraining.com In this video, we will talk about Cloud Computing Architecture You use browser of your computer to connect to Google Docs website in order to create documents in the cloud world Let's call your browser, the front end, and the data center at Google, the back end The front end is connected to the back end via internet when talking about a cloud computing system it's helpful to divide it into two sections you as a user only sees the front end that is your browser in this case the back end is the cloud section the cloud section is mainly a black box for the users they don't know what is going on in there mostly a web browser is used on the front end to connect to the cloud. However, that is not the case all the times. A custom applications could be used as well to make connection to the cloud. For example, your email app or Google Docs app on your smartphone. Now let's talk about what is inside the cloud. Cloud is nothing but a data center. Data center consists of many computers called servers. Some of the servers are dedicated to serve requests from users, while others hold the data. These are called data servers. Almost any program could be made to work in a cloud model. Examples are emails, spreadsheets, presentations, games, etc. Normally, each kind of program will have its own dedicated server to serve the request from users. The processes are running to monitor the traffic and the load and to cross check if everything is running smoothly. The servers are connected with each other to share the data and enable internal communication. That is why the data is cloned into multiple copies and the copies are spread over to different computers. The concept is called creating redundancy. The data is still accessible to the cloud users while the broken computer is getting replaced. To the cloud user, all look very simple, but there is a lot going on with the data center. That is the whole idea, users can focus on using the application. While, the cloud provider will take care of, the hardware and software maintenance. Thank you for watching. For more videos, please visit zero to protraining.com.